I've got to tell you, you may have lost your taste for this business, but you certainly have lost none of its skill. You were absolutely superb with that fire. You think so? Oh, God! Top-notch, first class. <laughs> What's so funny? Well, you had one on me. You know, I was absolutely convinced that you didn't want to go back to Port Charles because of Robert. And all along, I guess you were just trying to get Petrie's up the ante. I wish that were true. What do you mean? Barry, I have no intention of going to Port Charles today or any other day. What are you talking about? I'm going to buy a ticket to England. Uncle Clive is counting on us to finish this deal. I'll explain it to Uncle Clive when I get to England. Look, where have you been? You know as well as I do that our Mr. Petrie is not at all keen on me finishing this deal. Yeah, he wants both of us a low deal. Look, I'm not going to change my mind. I'm going. I'm not letting you do this, yeah? Barry, look, I love you dearly, but would you leave me alone? We're yeah, going well, too far. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Barry, leave me come alone. On. Otherwise, I'll do something that you don't want me to do. Come on, I come on. Said... I'm not letting you go. Come on. I said leave me alone, Barry. Come on. Leave me alone, Mark. Oh, don't be ridiculous. Come what's, on. What's the problem here? Look, there is no problem. I can explain. So this. can I. He's been pestering her. Thank she's you. my cousin. Yeah, she's I've our... never seen the man before in my life. Oh, come. You come with me. No. Look, I can explain this thing. Ow! Holy! That's really hurt. That's... Yes, hello. Um, I'd like a coach ticket to England as quickly as you can, please. to e throw and I'd like to turn it in. Want to exchange it for another flight? Oh, um, where to? Port Charles. Um, where's the next flight? Oh, uh, let's see here. Could you stop? <coughs> Please. Is this the place? Um, no, but, um, but I'll walk the rest of the way. Here you go. Oh, thanks. Hey, it's cold out there. You should let me take you right to your door. No, it's fine, really. I, 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 it's not that far. <laughs> oh, I'm terribly sorry, but we're closed. Hello. It's a ghost. No, I'm, I'm alive. Can I come in? Oh, yes, of course. But they said it was, it was a plane crash and that everybody in it was dead and, and that you were... Oh, where have you been all these years? <laughs> oh, Ruby, listen to me. It's imperative that I speak to Robert right away. Do you know where he lives now? Oh, of course, we're still friends. He was just here a few minutes ago. I, I mean, I, I gave him a sandwich to take down to the police station. Police station? Oh, I'm sure he's there by now. I can't go there. But you said you had to see him right away. Yeah, but I, I can't risk anybody seeing me. Uh, well, he lives at the Weber house now. Oh. Yes. Yes, I know where that is. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> um... Ruby, can I ask you something? Please don't tell anybody that you've seen me. Well, even if I did, who's going to believe me? So it's, it's our secret? 
whatever way you want it. Thank you. Okay, sweetie. You got it. Don't be a stranger. Come back. I will. <laughs> Excuse me, I, uh, I... Holly. What are you doing here? Waiting for you. This is kind of cold out here, why don't we go inside? You don't mind that I'm here? How do you think it matters? I mean, I know it's late. Uh, yeah. Well, anything look familiar here? The Webbers. Hey, you're cold. Can I get you a drink? Yes, please. Um, some sherry? Sure. Well, you haven't lost your flair for the dramatic. You're not upset that I'm here? Well, I wouldn't use the word upset. What would you use? Try confused. I'm sorry. Well, I doubt that. Otherwise, you wouldn't be here. So, what's up? You in trouble? This, this really isn't very easy for me, Robert. I think at this stage of our life, we know each other well enough, so why don't you just cut to the chase? I wasn't entirely honest with you about why I came back to New York. 